My name's Nick Shannon, uh, I'm a cabinet maker. The project I'm working on at the moment is quite an interesting one. It's a, a bespoke shepherd's hut. Yeah, an interesting project and it'll look great, I think, when it all comes together. I think my passion for wood is, is about the challenge of working with wood. Because it's such a tactile material, uh, it also has a, you know, each wood has a different scent. When I come to work in the morning, I know which wood I've been working on the day before because the workshop smells of it. After deciding not to go into teaching, I worked with a, a furniture restorer uh, for a few years, um, learning the, the, the business in, in and around Lyme Regis. Um, I've been a cabinet maker now for about 33 years, something like that, probably 34 years, um, which is uh, a bit alarming. <laughs> uh, never been employed. Always self-employed. I like to use sustainable woods, woods from sustainable sources, you know, resources that aren't uh, uh, plundering rainforests and things like that. I've made most things. I've made boats and I've made bridges and canoes, cabins, lots of tables, chairs. I really like the tables I make. Um, uh, I have a thing about tables. I think they, they're such a nice product because you know people are going to um, enjoy eating off them. They're going to enjoy touching them and looking at them and using them. They're functional, but they're also beautiful. So sort I of came across this idea where you set a magnet um, in with into your timber and have a nice veneer of well, this one's walnut. I uh, also managed to bond lovely old copper onto uh, timber as well. So you've got a, a lovely look with the uh, verdigris and the, the copper. A lot of the restoration I do is um, just repairs, a lot of broken chairs. Um, but there is also the side of restoration where there's more serious things that need doing where you're re-veneering um, surfaces and uh, making good old chests of drawers which are completely shattered and broken. Yeah, I've got a series of things to do after the Shepherd's Hut. People are um, putting together some ideas about uh, some quite complicated shelving in a barn conversion. Um, and I've got a kitchen to do for a lady. 